Well, Coach, welcome in and uh, an exciting season getting underway here shortly. And let's just talk about your expectations as a coach, as a coach of the uh, 2013 Huskies. Well, our team goal since the summer has been top 12, take our team to nationals. For the last two years, we have just missed being in the top 12 on our last routine at regionals. We're so close, but until you do it, until you do it, you're not one of those top programs. So we're determined we're going to do it this year. You've had an individual make nationals the last couple of years, Eliza Vacker. Talk about her strengths and what makes her so special as a gymnast. She's one that just is an all around. Any more college gymnasts are starting to be more specialists, so they don't have to be great all around. So Eliza is one of those gifted all around kids that you just expect to be there on every event. Pretty big senior class coming in. Talk about uh, what makes them so special. It seems like this year, more so than any season I've had here, and this is my seventh season, every single person is so bought in and so committed and we all have the same goals. I think it all starts with Paige Bixler and Lauren Rogers as our captains that the team voted for because they kind of set the tone for everybody else. If we nail this particular skill this year, we're going to be a great team. Balance Beam is the event many times that you win or lose a meet. And I think that's our strength this year. All 13 girls compete beam. We, we take our top six. Well, there's obviously some pressure being ranked in the top 20, which you guys are in the, in the preseason at 17. So talk a little bit about how your team, you feel they're equipped to handle that pressure. Normally, most years, I'd probably be kind of excited that we were 17th preseason or whatever. And this year, not at all. The team's not excited about it. I'm not excited about it because our goals are top 12. So I like it that no one's really that excited about 17th and we want to prove some people wrong.